just a heads up, the horrific violent crime you've seen pop up in places like New York, California, and others, that's a direct result of cashless bail. Take these violent criminals and just, you know, revolving door, just let them right out of prison. And what I said yesterday was, you need to get out. You need to get out of your blue area. You need to leave your blue area to the, to the animals, and you need to go take yourself and your family someplace where you can be safe because the national GOP isn't going to save you. And the outnumbered GOP in these blue areas isn't going to save you. But you can still have a really, really wonderful, normal-looking life if you pack it up and get to a red area where they lock up criminals and actually keep them locked up. And whenever I say things like this, you'll inevitably get somebody. I had people yesterday say, but Jesse, uh, Lee Zeldin almost won in New York. Lee Zeldin got blown out in New York. Oh, don't get me wrong. Lee Zeldin's a stud, and he overperformed, and he should be proud of what he did. I'm not ripping on Lee Zeldin, but Lee Zeldin got crushed in New York. What are you talking about? Uh, Lee Zeldin got crushed because he didn't get crushed as bad as the last guy. He still got crushed in New York. But Jesse, I'm, I'm never leaving. Okay, don't leave. Don't leave. You do what you want to do. I, I can't force you to do anything. Don't leave. But, you know, Florida had a million people, a million people plus, move into Florida over the last two years. Let me ask you something. Just, just, just let me ask you something. Have you heard a word from a single one of those people who moved to Florida? Have you heard one word about them, about how they regret it? Because I could show you email after email after email after email. I get to my show of Jesse, I moved. It's the best decision I ever made. Jesse, we got out last year. Best decision I ever made. Jesse, we got out five years ago. Best decision I ever made. No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stay and fight. Uh, Jesse, we can't seed ground. I get this all the time. So we should seed ground? Is Lizzo seeding ground to obesity? I'd say the ground is already lost. You're not seeding ground you've already lost. If your state cannot be saved, then stop trying to save it and get to a state where you can. And if you're worried about national elections, but Jesse, that'll, that'll hurt national elections. You do understand that your state gets so many congressional seats and electoral votes based on the population of the state, right? So if you were to take all these wonderful Republicans, and there are a bunch of them in a state like, oh, California, and you're to take all those millions of Republicans in the state of California and move them all to red states, one, California hemorrhages electoral college votes, and two, that red state where all those Republicans move to gains electoral college votes. You know who you're helping by living in a crime-ridden blue hellhole that hates you? You know who you're helping? No one. You're not aiding the cause. Not at all. You want to stay for family reasons? I get that. That happens. You want to stay for because you can't find new work or something? I get it. People have bills to pay. I'm not naive. But just take it from me as someone who's done it, as someone who's moved from blue to red. It's a better life, man. Don't miss Jesse Kelly Breaks History, The Forgotten Genocide, the first episode of a new series available now exclusively for First TV supporters. Visit the First TV app or thefirsttv.com to subscribe and start watching today.